While the presidential race is the one capturing the country's attention from coast to coast, here in Mississippi, the most significant race nationally as well as statewide is the Senate race between Republican Cindy Hyde-Smith and her Democratic challenger Mike Espy. And only second to winning the White House is keeping control of the Senate by the Republicans or gaining control of it by the Democrats, so the whole country is watching this race. And 12 News, Jake Alexa is live with the, I hear him now, boy, they're out there, aren't they? He's, Jake Alexa is live at the Mississippi Ag Museum where Cindy Hyde-Smith will hold her watch party tonight. Jade, what can you tell us? Here at the Ag Museum is where Republicans will gather to watch those returns come in. And folks are here putting the finishing touches here for the watch party. Take a look. And just to give you some background on this race, then Governor Phil Bryan appointed Cindy Hyde Smith to the position when Thad Cochran stepped down for health reasons. Then there was a special election in 2018 where she beat Democrat Mike Espy. Now here we are in 2020 where she is facing another tough challenge from Espy. But the state hasn't sent a Democrat to the Senate since 1982. And Cindy Hyde-Smith was out defending her seat, trying to get those last-minute voters today. We spoke to her, and here's what she had to say. We feel great. We're so glad November the 3rd is here. But we feel very good about the election. We're going to wind it up tonight. We've worked hard and uh, just love working for the people of Mississippi and sure hope they give me the opportunity to continue doing that. She also cast her vote in her home of Brookhaven. We're going to hear from her again coming up tonight at 5. Back to you.